parkour. It can be called the art of displacement, although it might be easier to call it street gymnastics. Practitioners attempt to move through an urban environment as quickly and efficiently as possible. Some of the movements involved with parkour include climbing, swinging, jumping, vaulting, and rolling or flipping. The Windsor Parkour Training Association was founded in 2006 and boasts over 75 members. But with the cold and snowy winter, the parkour season comes to a halt. President Chris Govan, also known as Ninja, recommends parkourists continue their stretching flexibility and athletic training at home in the off-season. We teach in the philosophy that if you can get through an obstacle, um, such as a backflip, front flip that you fear, what makes you yourself think that you cannot get over an obstacle in your everyday life that you think, may think that is nearly impossible to accomplish? Sylvain Sassine was trained by Govan, and he is one of the founding members of the WPTA. He says he is happy to have conquered the initial fear he had when he first started to do parkour. I get a lot of thrill, excitement and everything from continuing this type of lifestyle and I still look to further myself uh, in the sport. Meetings and training are free and anyone looking for more information can head to windsorparkour.com. For Mediaplex News Now, I'm Jamie Adams.